Hello everyone, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use SAS or SCSS in view projects that has feed configuration. As you see over here, a view project has used feed as a configuration. So how to config SAS in this project? All right, let's get started. First of all, I just want you to go to feed website, vjs.dev and go to guide and then search for uh, SAS okay as we know SAS is CSS preprocessor so this is how you can install SAS in feed project okay you just copy this and then go back to view project okay and we have to stop view projects first I will type control C and then type yes and paste the command over here npm add dash d sas hit enter so after the installation is done let's start the view projects again npm run dev uh, using sas in view projects that has this configuration is pretty easy so you go to view files for example over here i'm going to use sas over here so i put length equal to SCLS. All right, let's try our first SCLS over here. Our BG color red. Okay, save. Okay, let's change this div to be blue. Okay, class hello. Okay, and then dot hello over here. And over here, background color should be variable BG color. Okay, save. So let's go back to our website. You will see background color change to red. All right, this is correct. How about nesting? Does nesting work? So let's put span over here. Okay. And I put class over here. Child's hello. Okay, let's put child hello over here. Child hello. Background color green save okay let's go back here see that's work so you can create a files for scss as well for example you go to asset over here let me create a styles dot scss so let me copy this one and paste it over here so now over here we can import styles directly from here so add import asset okay and then style save let's go back to our website it's work the same and how about if we comment this import so there is no styles over here so let's enable the import again I can even change main to SCSS as well so main SCSS instead of using CSS we use SCSS okay let's go back to main.js over here let's go to here and you have to change this one to scss because we have changed it from css to scss okay for example over here if i put like body background color blue okay save let's check see it's work how about i declare like bg body okay blue so how about i copy this variable and paste it over here does this work so let's see so it works so it's work the same so you can even change base here from css to scss okay and when you import from here you have to make sure that you have changed this to be scss as well okay all five in our projects right now is changed from css to scss Okay, and let's check it again. So it's work the same. All right, this is all about this tutorial. If you like this tutorial, don't forget to click like, subscribe, and don't forget to comment down below. Thank you so much for watching.